it's a bit of a kind of an update it's kind of a, a moment where i'm a bit pissed off but pff, what can you do um that's the thing i didn't set up My name is Mark, welcome back to the shop, and today we're going to be talking about something. Um, there'll be a. Let me just close that door. There'll be a, a, an update. Um, no, this is the update, sorry. <laughs> Cut that shit. Dropping. Hopefully. Yes, update time. Um. A few people are aware of this in the background, um, and it's about the channel's future. It's not bad. Well, no, it's not bad. It's not bad in the grand scheme of things. It's just a fucking pain around because of this coof coof malarkey. Um, the general idea was to uh, for me to move. A lot of people, you know, know that. So if you're not a regular or you don't care about this shit. I don't mind if you just fucking skip to the next video kind of thing. Um, but there was the whole being stuck down south and not knowing what, what's going to happen, not knowing when I'm moving, where I'm moving to, so on and so forth. And all that kind of malarkey. So I moved, did all that, and then... I moved when this was happening, so it's when all this running around screaming, afraid of the Chinese, uh, whatever it is. Uh, you can't mention, I've been, been very careful to skirt round and call it the coof coof or something, because you ca YouTube will shut people down and talk about it, it's to the point where it's a bit ridiculous, but who cares, I don't need to say what it is. I've kind of not mentioned it in any of the videos, once or twice I've said something like, you know, this stupid virus malarkey, but apart from that I haven't mentioned it. Um, so the, there was a plan in place. The plan was to move up here, find somewhere to a workshop and go from there. But with all this stuff going on and yeah, that kind of wasn't going to happen. So talking with the boss, she came out with the idea of, well, why don't we do it here? At the house kind of thing. And I said, man, you know. Long story short, um, that's the ultimate future. Now, <laughs> things were going along as things were going on. And I should now be doing the first video in the new workshop. Basically a giant shed, but with power and everything that I need and tooling and everything I need on my old stuff and we can actually get on with doing stuff now it's kind of just <sighs> so the the hold up here is well two things with the hold up one I fuck my knee like badly um, which slowed everything down. It was meant to be November, so the big unveil was meant to be November. And that kind of got slowed down an awful lot because of my knee. Um, there's some stuff I've got to do, like move some stuff. Some people on Facebook might have seen these pictures. Um, a series of bad weather. Christmas full stop. Lockdowns on and off, on and off, on and off, on and off. And the, sh the the shed suppliers, the workshop suppliers. So this is, it's not a, sh it is a shed, but it's a big fuck off shed, right? A big one. And it's more like, a, almost like a log cabin kind of thing. Any road. So with all this going on, that has been pushed back because it's literally, I want to buy that one. Yeah, you, there's a massive, 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 massive waiting list. And when I say massive, I mean fucking massive. Everyone... What I what I want, everyone doesn't have, right? They don't have for a long time. Uh, I was told back at Christmas time ish, twenty two weeks. So that's where we are now. Paid the deposit, paid you know we're paying half of it up to now and got nothing yet, just waiting. So 
yeah, it's just a pain in the ass. And it was meant to be totally different, right? There's meant to be a totally different thing. I was hoping to be in and set up by Christmas. Any road, it isn't. Things are massively delayed. Um, and I haven't set anything up. There's the outhouse, but that's full of shit, to be quite honest. It's just full of stuff. Uh, actually, trying to sort out the land around the back of here and, uh, and other jobs that I'm doing. It's just a nightmare. Any road. So... Um, just to so what I'm doing at the moment is I'm doing a lot of videos as you've noticed sat here at the desk maybe some at the whiteboard in the outhouse stuff like that but it's still yeah there's nothing much going on right I wanted to get a lot going on um, I was trying to build up to it regardless what I'm going to do is show you uh, a CAD model up here I'll show you on the screen but I'll show you basically what it's going to look like now it's not entirely like this because i changed my mind slightly just at an orientation but this will give you an idea so i'll show you the screen not this view because that's crap um so what you can see here is basically it's got a side entrance and a um double doors jobby at the front here and i'm not going to use that double door jobby until it, it, it's for getting everything in It'll only be the base of the side door. There is windows. I ain't bothered putting that shit in because there's no point. I'm not bothered about that. This is just a layout. But basically, I need to build up some of these benches. So these are going to be a square box section steel tubing. Not tubing, but you get what I mean. A box section. I'm just going to say it again. Tubing. So we're going to make these. and Weld all these together and some shelving unit. Really strong shit. And the reason why is these shelves here, they're going to need to hold engines um, on these shelves here. And then a partition wall, you know, I haven't done all the detail, just made it as thick as the wall needs to be. And then in this section here, this section at the back, will be the lathe, milling machine, and some few other bits and pieces, depending on how much room we've actually got, so on and so forth. And then in this section, some more benches, and this is going to be the dirty section, you know, sandblasting cabinet in there, belt sander grinders, that kind of rubbish, blah, 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 blah. And then put the uh, bike, God, oh, fuck, I hate doing this kind of orientation. Put the bike lift in here like this, and then that can be put over there. It can be collapsed. It can be, oh, I was even thinking about shoving it under something, but we'll see how we go. But basically, I can move that over there like that and have a stool or something. I don't know, you know, when you get into these things, I'm just trying to see how things will fit. What's more important to me is these, not entirely rooms, but roomed off sections. This will have a door on it because that's the dirty, shitty dust and crap and everything in there, grinding, all that kind of rubbish. You know, so basically, there's two, there's like a dirty end. <laughs> there's a dirty end, which is where all the uh, covert photography goes on, which is down this end. And then there's the cleaner end. This is more assembly, stripping shit like that. And then all the dirty shit gets bunged in here. And then all the swarf and shit can get to stay in there. So that's basically it. It's a 6 by 5 so 6 metres the long edge, this one here. And then 5 metres the smaller edge kind of thing like that. And it'll just be absolutely fucking hunky-dory. And it means I can start really getting on and doing some stuff. Some proper stuff, not fanning around. But, um, yeah, I think, you know, the sectioned off sections, I might even, you know, like this swarf area here, the, the, it has got a, a, a proper roof, you know, like a, a apex roof kind of thing, and these cavity walls will go up to the top of that, you know what I mean? It's just not, I'm not showing it here. Because this is just basically bung together so I can move stuff around and think, oh, you know, I want that, I want this over here, and I can just swap stuff, obviously everything's not defined obviously that's fucking just sliding about you know and this may change to a certain degree it's just the way it goes and the reason why these are all in sections is so that the standalone unit so if i ever do need to get on the doors i can just remove that center one and get through the double doors if i ever need to you know what i mean stuff like that so like i said this isn't a perfect bloody model it's just to give you and me an idea of what's going on um so yeah, you know, that's, it was meant to be February, it was meant to be December, I was ready to 
getting everything ready in this was in August in everything I had everything planned out and then delay after delay after delay of delivery of things delay after delay after delay of all this other shit put it all the way back to February so I was like right February and the thing is um, I was told in October when I rang them yep we can make a February deadline and then it was like ring up a month later to say right I want it oh no it's been pushed back to February uh, we can't give you an exact date yet ring after Christmas after Christmas ring them give us two weeks because it's all over the shop at the end of the day we're trying to sort out all this rubbish right beginning of February basically end of January rang them it's going to be 22 weeks I said right well I need to fucking you know I need that in stone and they said well if you want it in stone like that uh, no, yes, sorry, we have been fanning around. Yes, we can guarantee you. And they didn't give me a number. This is yours. It's This is the pack, blah, 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 blah. It is now yours. It's your order. So, 22 weeks from then. Fuck knows when that was. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. I'm going to sit here and count it. I'm only laughing. Um, it can be beforehand. So April, May, um, you know, I could have kept this quiet and just, da da, it's here. But I don't know why I didn't. Why didn't I? I didn't for some reason. I just wanted to show you what's going on. And the fact is, yes, I am trying to make progress. Some people have said you've just. Some people are saying you've moved. You know what's happening? I thought you said things are gonna. I've moved. Virus has fucked everyone's life up. You know what I mean? What else can I say? It's fucked everybody's life up to some degree. Some people aren't that bothered, you know, some people aren't affected that much, but for me, mostly it didn't until this happened, you know what I mean? So, I'll just keep on going until it's sorted, you know what I mean? I'm not on a video of the build or anything, I'm, you know, this whole video series of moving from one building to another is fucking shit. And you know what I'm talking about, fuck's sake. It's just make anything and make a video about it. So all of this stuff I've been doing all these months trying to sort this shit out. This is the first and last time I'll literally talk about it. It's it's also for me is this is like a video diary. You know, people call them vlogs. But it's a video diary is this. Of not just, you know, for me personally, I get to look back at fucking around with Craig and stuff. I get to look back at fucking around with Tim and Andy. I get to look back at messing around with Isaac and stuff. It's a diary for me is this much as anything. This is parts of my life, chronological order kind of stuff. And I want to make a record of this bit. I've been quite miffed. <laughs> you know what I mean? And then we get, I, get, I get to look back at this and laugh. You know, so there's that kind of stuff. So this is only if you're interested. If you're interested, you're interested. If you're not, you're not. I hope that makes sense. I'll see you in a bit.